Hey, how's it going guys? So today we're gonna to be working on the Z4. BMWs tend to have a lot of issues when it comes to these windshield cowls, cause uh, over time they start to uh, crack and deteriorate cause they're made of plastic. And so as you can see here, you know, it's just falling apart and uh, I'm gonna get that replaced today. So this is the new panel that we're gonna be putting on. I'm probably gonna use some uh, trim protection on it so that the same thing doesn't happen or at least I can slow it down as much as I can uh, But the process of removing it. I'm just basically Basing it off of the clips that are on this one shouldn't be too difficult First thing is to pop the hood of course All right Once that's off, I think the most important thing that you have to do is to get the windshield wiper arms off. So that's what I'm gonna do now. There's covers on them that can come right off. I'll leave them here so they don't get lost. Okay, this is a 16 millimeter bolt. Let's get this off. Same thing for the other one. So I'm just removing some clips with a Phillips screwdriver. One here, one here, and probably one on the other side. I'll get to that in a second. Okay, so I guess you just gotta be a little bit more aggressive with them when you try and remove the uh, windshield, wi windshield wipers. It comes off actually pretty easy once you loosen them up, but probably because they've been sitting there for so long, it's hard to remove them. Removing the windshield wipers as well as four clips and you should be able to lift up this panel. We'll see if we can now. Okay, let's get these. Alright, you gotta take off these two clips here too so that this hose can be uh, moved back. This thing has become very, very brittle. Okay, whole thing came off. Let's, I don't know what this is doing here, but that's fine. All right, so I'm gonna clean this out and then install the new one and that's it. All right, took about 15 to 20 minutes to do that job. Getting bit my mosquitoes and all, which was really annoying. Just gonna apply some turtle wax super protectant onto it and then we'll be completely done. Appreciate you guys watching. If you guys have any questions about this, let me know. The next thing that I'm going to do is actually restore this uh, windshield trim which goes around. As you can see, this part is completely cracked as well. You actually don't need to remove your windshield in order to change the windshield trim. I'll show you guys how to do that the next time that we meet. Alright guys, I'll see you guys later.